effects of Red Dead Redemption 2. All right, we're gonna do uh, Mika's, Mika, Mika, whatever mission. Where the hell is he? There he is. You can calm the fuck down. Mika. Ah, there he is, old Black Lung Morgan. Shut up. Was you followed? Excuse me. Was you followed? You know who you're talking to. I ain't sure. I ain't sure about much no more. All I know is there's law whenever you're around. Is that so? Mm. Because it seems to me that since you've been riding with us, there ain't been nothing but trouble. Stirring things up all the time, getting in Dutch's ear. Seems wherever you is, there's Pinkertons and vice versa. So you better watch your goddamn mouth, boy. <laughs> or... <laughs> <laughs> Take it easy, cowboy. You're gonna do yourself a mischief way your head. Micah, shut it! He started Micah. it! <sighs> Dutch says we is to go on with plans to create a diversion. We gotta get some explosives to blow up the bridge. Keep the army out of here a few days. I think it's a real bad idea. I don't think Dutch cares too much what you think. That's clear. We gotta confuse him one last time. Then he and I will head to Blackwater, collect the money, and help everyone leave. He's got a boat lined up. Blackwater's a fool's errand. Everyone knows it. Even a greedy moron like you. It's Dutch's choice, Arthur. You're just a senior gun, same as the rest of us. Only you ain't well. I'm fine. Then you'll do Dutch's bidding. Which is robbing a stage that's coming from Annisburg full of explosives. Rob a stage. All we seem to ever do is rob a stage, you and me. Not me. You <laughs> two. I got my own planning to do. You boys got this. Shit. Well, guess we have. Come on, Arthur. And cowpoke. And take it easy. You could do with a vacation. Hmm? <coughs> <laughs> Fuck you, Micah. <laughs> All right, let's go. Yeah, I guess. Let's okay, go. girl. Good boy. Micah says we should jump it as soon as it comes through Van Horn. So you're taking orders from him now? I'm taking orders from Dutch, same as always. A pair of them are becoming unhinged. You hear about Dutch killing Cornwall? Hey, hold up a second. Pinkerton patrol over there. Yes. Yeah, okay, him. I think we're clear. Let's head off. So, you were saying? Well, that needed to be done. Right now? <laughs> With the Pinkertons breathing down our necks? See? I'm starting to think that you've gone really soft, Morgan. It's not about being soft, it's about being smart. Okay, let's hold up here. So, wagon will be coming from that way, down from Annisburg. And it'll take the two of us to stop it completely or it'll never get done. So, I was thinking, you go play dead, and I'll take care of him. <laughs> no, I'm the better shot, and you, you're the better actor. No, you play dead, and I'll cover you. I got that. <coughs> I got that. Oh, that's them coming now, I think. It'll be quite the show. <laughs>
Headshot. Trying to shoot their horse. This is not the best weapon to do that. Let's What's wrong, Arthur? Nothing at all, boss. John, go drive this over to Bacchus Bridge. Get a hidden near there. He really does think Bill, he's in charge. You go on ahead. I need to speak with Arthur. Good work, son. What's going on? Listen, I know we ain't always seen eye to eye, and uh, you find me irritating and a threat, and I like to annoy you. Right, right now, I need better from you, Arthur. Okay, Micah. Whatever you say. I ain't the bad guy you think I am, Arthur. But I am a survivor. Stick with me and you'll live. Oh, the bridge is probably a two-man job. You should probably go help Marston. Why don't you? Like I said, Dutch and I got planning to do for the train. There's a big picture here, Arthur. Mm -hmm. Trust me. Alrighty, well, come on. Yeah, it's cool. <coughs> Shot complete. Oh, okay. Well. Yeah. Uh, we got hers, and that's about it. All right, let's go to Sadie. Yep. 
crazy, crazy Sadie. Crazy, crazy, say it. <clears throat> yeah, that's my girl. <laughs> that fox up there. Alright, no ambushes. Come on, no ambushes, boys. Yep, don't mind me. Probably just a wild animal. Yeah, that's my girl. <clears throat> There's a girl. <laughs> Gotta go this way. <laughs> Investigating what went down. You're all right, girl. Blue water marsh. Doing good, girl. Stay on this. Yeah. Get this soon. Good girl. You know what, I'm not even gonna bother anyone that's here. It is what it is. <laughs> Good girl. Yeah. Bye, you. N.W.A. The doggy. Good girl. God damn it. And for what? A few dollars? Sorry, mister. I think you got me mixed up with someone. No, no. I never forget a face. Never. George, spending your blood money. I tell you what. Those people got what was coming to them. Now get before I decide you got something coming too. You devil. You get away! Or what? Huh? Or what? Huh? What the hell? You completely what? insane? Should have moved. I'm done with this shit. That's right. 
Christ, bitch. Oh, wrong door. Okay. Be coming up on over here. Talking that shit. Don't you worry about me. There you are. Here oh, I am. Come on. Let's go. Let's go where? And why are you so riled up? Today is a great day, Arthur. Today is the day they are going to hang Colm O'Driscoll. That's uh, so. Either they hang him or I shoot him. Oh, they are gonna hang him. Yeah, and not before time. That boy's been on the gallows more than most. I wouldn't count anything until his neck's broke. Well, nor would I. Which is why, despite us being wanted men, we're gonna attend the event ourselves. And follow him onto the scaffold? Well, let's hope not. But if I could see that son of a bitch breathe his last, I think I'd die a happy man. We are gonna disguise ourselves. In this? Oh my god. In this. We're cops. <laughs> we are the law. <laughs> Where's, where, what happened to Sadie? Okay. Come on. Well, don't we just look the part? We'll cut through the alley to get to the gallows. We keep our weapons holstered, our disguises on, and our wits about us. I want to keep this disguise. Mrs. Adler, might I say, being a fancy woman of San Denis suits you. Huh. I'd dress up like the Queen of Sheba if it meant seeing that son of a bitch swing. Colm hung me up. Nearly butchered me. I don't mean I'm comfortable in this woolen coat. You made it out of that predicament, as I remember, Mr. Morgan. My husband weren't so lucky. You lost your husband. I lost my darling Annabelle. That poor boy Kieran. We've all lost something because of Comb. And that is why we will shepherd him to eternity. Hey, what's up, Amen ladies? to that. Hey. Keep those fingers off those triggers, because we'll need cool heads and calm dispositions to see this done. <laughs> Practice what you preach, brother. Whatever do you mean? Are you going to keep your cool? Really? When you seem to lose it all <clears throat> so often now. I've seen you choke an old lady out, question right? Any yours? I miss the old Arthur. Don't we all? You two quit it. Y'all got a job to do. We're all in rough agreement about how we're doing it, as far as I can tell. Exactly. We'll get it done, all right. All right, then. Come on. We got a hanging to witness. Yep. Look here. Don't the public love an execution? Yes. I think we all do. We should bring this back. 2019. Public executions. Hey. All right. Good. Now, you see that pair of assholes? Sure. They're Combs boys. Yes, I think so. What a surprise. I'm glad we're here. What are they pointing at? I don't know. We gotta follow them and find out. Yeah. Oh, here comes somebody. <clears throat> Stay here. Don't do nothing. Yeah, be cool. Be cool, Sadie. Go brush that horse, officer. Yes, sir. The crowd came to see a show. We don't want to disappoint them. I guess they did miss their chance to see John swing by his neck. Hey. Hey, you know I wasn't going to let it come to that. I guess I don't know what I know no more. And I guess this isn't the time to question either my decisions or yours. Here and now, Colm O'Driscoll's going to get his due. I mean, I don't know, man. Kind of, kind of left me there too. I had to, I had to escape myself. I don't know. No, you lied. Let's go. Quiet. What do you think? I'm told the stall's up on the roof. Once he starts shooting, we have to have our wits about us and move fast. Yeah, I guess we face worse than this before. Yeah. Sure. Let's get to it. Yeah. 
So, they got a guy up on the roof overlooking the gallows. Find a way up there, on one of these verandas, through a building maybe, and get him. And do it silently. Well, obviously, I'm gonna do it silently. I wanna see this bastard swing. Use a ladder. Find a way up to the roof and stop him. I'll go back to Mrs. Adler. Where's this shooter now? across five states, seemingly with impunity. Today, justice catches up with him. <laughs> As well you may. I've been a bad man. Silence! These charges This are... is not a court where you shall be tried. This is a place where your sentence is to be carried out. And your sentence, Colm O'Driscoll, is that you are to be hanged by the neck until you are dead. This is not a task we take lightly. It is not a task we uh -huh. enjoy. Hi. But it is a task we must carry out if our civilization is to prosper. Gentlemen, are we ready? Oh, he Call knows Lord he's fucked now. May God, in his infinite wisdom, have mercy upon your soul. Whenever you are ready. <laughs> now you know how it feels to watch somebody you love die. You ruined my life! God damn! Oh, right in the dick.
dead. Alright, you guys go. Well, we got him. Let's just get out of here. Go. Alright, peace. <laughs> He's not dead. Well then, old Driscoll is dead. Oh, nice. They took me back to camp. How you get on, Arthur? Well, <clears throat> we saw the bastard hang okay, but <clears throat> no thing ain't gonna save us. I guess that's one less thing to worry about. I guess, compared to the entire government, <laughs> in the end, Como Driscoll didn't seem like such a worry. I got a thing for you. Oh, okay. Oh, thank you. I know it's from that Mary. Ooh. Mary? She ain't worth it, Arthur. Who is? <laughs> she gave back to me. My dear Arthur, you never showed up. And now, after looking at the newspapers, I understand why. I don't imagine you'll receive this letter, but I nonetheless must send it. Arthur. Oh, Arthur. Wait, what? I was just starting to dream the silliest and softest of dreams. I miss you, and I will always miss you. But I cannot live like that. And it seems you cannot live any other way. When I'm with you, the world makes sense, but when we are apart, I see clearly that your world is not a world from which one can escape. I'm so sorry for everything. For everything long ago and for starting up that business again. There's a good man within you, Arthur, but he is wrestling with a giant. And the giant wins time and again you've broken my heart again i didn't even know I and i fear i have her. broken yours and for that i will never forgive myself but you must let me go now i enclose a ring you gave me many years ago when we were both young not because i don't like it but because i care for it far too much and it reminds me too much of you I hope one day you will find some people in love who can use this. For it kept me thinking of you all these years. And I hope by returning it to you, I can finally be free. Goodbye, Mary. This bitch. Ah. Fucking asshole. Got Mom's ring back. Nice. Hey, Arthur. Oh, hey. Mary Beth. Hey, Mary Beth. Okay. Hey. <coughs> Hi, so what? What's not? What's next? I wonder. Let's see. Too, Uncle. What's going to happen, you know? To everybody. I don't know. Uh, I guess folks is going to make a choice. Whether they live or die. And you? I don't have that choice no more. I'm just trying to help others see clearly. That's my choice. You're a good man, Arthur Morgan. A good man. 
I'm sorry, Jack. Where's he gone? Did he run off? Can I, like, track the scent of the dog? Hey, Morgan. Williamson? Hey, you still drunk, yeah. Karen? You don't look so good. Yeah, you're drunk. <coughs> so you think... You think Dutch has lost his mind, Arthur? I don't know anymore. I'm not sure I even care. Well, Micah... Micah says you've been saying crazy things about him. Micah. <laughs> Micah's an asshole. Keep an eye out for Micah, Bill. He says a whole lot. All right, well, this this is where I'm going to end the episode. So, thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to like button and, of course, subscribe for more. Now, I'll see you all next time. Peace.